Hey you guys, it's your girl Dodge coming back to you from Real Takes. Uh, today I'll be doing a reaction to a movie titled uh, The Billionaire Boys Club. Don't know anything about this. Truly I'm going in blind. So you know what? I'm going to leave my rant at the end. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it. What's the difference between a bad guy and a good guy who does bad things? Where's the line between white lie and outright evil? I want you to play well, He's in this. Erichiton. Okay. You remember Joe Hunt I was telling you about? Joe is a genius. I would love to hear your investment strategy. Gentlemen, how about we make some new money? The BBC. The only difference between high risk investing okay, and BBC, huh? Is how it all ends. This deal is worth a quarter of a billion dollars. Oh, he's in this. Interesting. Lives will never be the same. Billionaire boys. Have you ever driven a new car before? This car is worth more than my apartment. I'm winning, 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 I'm winning. You're kind of all over the place, Joe. Diverting investments to pay expenses. In the Roberts, okay. Well, you knew. I'm from Wall Street. Do you think people really get rich playing by the rules? Where's the money? There was never any money. Ron had a fake account. Oh, snap. Ron me down, Sid. I owe a lot of money to a lot of people. I need to pay them back. If the BBC creators, every document will be under the microscope of the IRS, the SEC, the FBI. What would you do to make him give us our money back? Sometimes the truth is the best lie. Uh, Tape your mouth shut so no one can hear him squeal. Where's Mom Levin? What did you do? There's only one move here. Terrorize and end this. Hmm. All right, you guys, I actually did enjoy the trailer. This kind of reminds me of something I've seen before. The premise overall of the money, you know, living a fast life and then, you know, find out you've been scam caught and then you have to find things to do to make it right, to pay whoever you owe. I swear I've seen something similar to this, whichever. No names coming to the top of my head, but trust and believe me, I know I'm not that far off when I say that. Um, the cast is great. Um, Kevin Spacey. We have Emma Roberts, Teron Edgerton, which I know he's in another movie which I want to see, which is Robin Hood. Then you have Bokeem Woodbine. He's one of my favorite actors. I, I know that face as soon as I saw it. And then, of course, um, I think I saw Suki Waterhouse in this. I'm familiar with a little bit of her work. So a nice little cast, you know, just from some names I'm probably missing, but just the gist of it looks really good. Now, even though I enjoy the trailer, I'm not sure if I want to go see this. Now, if they come up with another trailer that kind of piques me a little bit more, it's a possibility I can change my mind. But right now, I'm looking at the fact of waiting for this to actually come out, and I'll just enjoy this in the comfort of my own home. Now, you know, like I said, I can't change my mind. It can't happen. But with that said, that's kind of where I'm leaning more towards. So basically, you guys, comment below. Let me know what you all think. If this is something you all plan to see, you know, if you like the casting, that might bring you out to the theaters. Hey, nothing wrong with that. So with that said, you guys, I will see you in the next reaction. You guys take care.